Hey, what's going on, y'all? Thank you for joining me on my daily vlog. We're here at my brother's house, or sister-in-law's house, and we're gonna do something different today. Uh, normally, I go out and eat, but today I'm gonna actually, she's gonna make one of my favorite dishes, so I'm gonna um, show you her techniques and all that stuff. You know, you guys can steal it. Make sure you follow her. What's your, what you want? What, what is your kitchen name? This kitchen name, not my cuisine. cuisine. My cuisine, I guess? I don't know. This, I guess, is the first time we're uh, showing them cook on my on my page. So we're gonna make one of my favorite dishes of all time. Actually, I shouldn't say all time because I'm I'm fronting right now. We're gonna make one of my favorite dishes as an adult because as a kid I used to hate this dish a lot, but as an adult your your taste buds change and you know uh, you get to appreciate the health benefits of this dish. So we're gonna make bitter melon stir fry with beef, right? It's gonna be with beef. Yeah. Okay. So it's gonna be with beef, and uh, we're gonna walk you through the process. We're gonna have my, my sister-in-law is gonna make the dish, so we're gonna have her speak about it. She might she may speak in English, she may speak in Cambodian. I don't know what you guys want. Do you want the authentic Khmer language, or do you want her to speak in broken English? Both. We'll see. Broken and <laughs> All right, let's go check it out. Tell us about your technique. What do you have to do? What technique? I don't have any technique. Technique? So what are you doing with the bitter melon? How do yeah. you pick the bitter melon? Is there like a way you have to pick it when it's still young or uh, you pick anything? No, I, yeah, it's, I don't so have it's a technique. It's just look by, basically look by it's the buttermelon <coughs> when it doesn't have like, um, what is it called? I don't know what it's called, like when it's dead. Say it in Khmer. Kala, kala, we bite it, but I we chat it, I, 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 I don't know. I don't know. fry like that but if you don't like it to be so bitter yeah. you can put salt a little bit and then start to um, start to squeeze it out a little bit I wish you how to do it so. you just put just spray salt a little bit on top of the um, the bitter the bitter melon mm -hmm. so this is the way old generation do it if you want to, if you don't want it to be so bitter just squeeze it out a little bit and then um, wash it with water but if you want to be so if you want to be so bitter, you don't have to do anything, just still fry. So basically the salt kind of like, kind of wash out um, okay. the, the juice of it. Yeah. Cuss it down. Mm -hmm. Until the garlic's brown, smell the. Yeah. And then. Oh. And then, by the way, start to put ingredient in there. Yeah. And 
then after that, put this in. Beautiful. Last but not least, at the end, you can just put the um, oyster sauce a little bit to give it flavor. Bad boy. And bitter melon have a lot of benefit over that, like treat cancer. Um, but no, but I'm, I don't know what this is. Who taught you how to cook? Uh, just watch from old people. Not really. You learn, you learn how to cook over time, basically. Yeah, probably there. Yeah. If you guys want me to do more cooking videos in here, just give me a thumbs up and let me know. I wouldn't mind coming over here because my kitchen is mad small and they live in a nice neighborhood, you know. I still live in the hood. Let me know. Give me a thumbs up. Actually, watch all my videos if you want to buy me a new house so I can cook for y'all. I just watched them prep the, the whole thing and it's, it's pretty easy for this dish. I'm, I'm, I can't wait to make it at home. It seems mad easy. We about to chow down. And I can't wait, I'm starving right now. Need some rice, you know, of course. Y'all don't know, I am, I'm ready to feast right now. We got uh, the stir fry, but also she made soup. Sing out what? Sing out one? Sing out one jamoy vegetable. I don't know, it's a green vegetable. <laughs> I have no idea what the name is right now. Well, I'm about to go in on this, uh, this stir fry though. This bitter melon beef stir fry. I've been waiting all day for this. Let's go ahead and try it out. Can y'all see that? Can you come and eat? Mm. Okay, Just the right amount of bitter in there. Still got that crunch. That beef is great. Everything is seasoned right. Man, this is a feast. But this is mandatory when you're eating too. We got the uh, fish, dipping sauce. the dipping sauce, the fish sauce with the Thai chili pepper, and what's that? Basil or something like that? Chico Hom. Chico Hom. What you do is, it ain't dipping sauce. You actually take that sauce and put it on top of each bite, right? And that's something special. Let's go for another bite here. We're gonna be in a high ass tax bracket here in Cherry Hill East. But we live we're eating off of paper plates, you heard? We keeping a hood, you know what I'm saying? Tax bracket like twenty thousand a year. But then we eating out of styrofoam plates. That's how that's how you live out here. Let's do this again. I can't wait for this one. We're gonna do it for a big bite right now. I used to hate that so much, but now I love every bite of it. You get more Campbell than this. Who's that first person to be like, you know what? 
that's a bitter that's a bitter vegetable but we're gonna eat it anyways who said that no one said that hungry people said that hungry people eat anything So let's try this soup out. Bitter melon. That soup is good. That soup is healthy. You can just taste the healthiness in it. It's a nice light soup. My people, we always always have our protein, and we always have the soup too. This is how we get down, y'all. Right? This is good, Maddie. It's delicious. That's right. Everybody, go follow Madison. At MadisonIKeepItReal.com. <laughs> this is so good. I might just do the hype dance right outside. I think I might do that after dinner. So I'm gonna go ahead and finish this dinner right here. It's delicious. Uh, do me a favor. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. Make sure you follow Kamai Cuisine. If you guys want one more of these home cooking videos, actually home cooking videos is better for me right now because I got a kid. I got a newborn. And uh, eating out can cost a lot of money from time to time. So uh, you guys should just do me a favor and just want more of these videos so I can cook at the house, have a home cooked meal, lose some weight, look sexy in my next video, you know? But until then, we out of here. Go peep out my dance video right now. Bye. Make sure you subscribe, like, and comment down below what's your favorite Cambodian food. If you don't like Cambodian food, what's your favorite McDonald's? Have a nice day. Bye. So, since you guys stayed to the end, I'll do the hike. Have a nice day. Subscribe. How do I turn this off?